Hello, once again, YouTube! I'm playing an entirely new game today called Rising World. Now, I have never played this game before. Uh, create a new GIW Games account. Alright, oh, okay, so I guess it's kind of like Minecraft where I have to make a username and password to log in. Uh, okay, well, I will be back when I've done that. Okay, so I'm back and I've made an account. Now then, um, let's just do single player. A uh, new world. Okay. New world shall be called uh, Nigel and Friends. I'll just leave the seed as it is. Uh, game mode Survival Creative Standard Adventure. Adventure sounds good. Adventure is not. Oh, it's not available yet. And then creative. A oh, creative is available. Standard is not available yet. Okay, so let's just let's just do survival. World type. Normal. Caves. Oh right. Oh, so I can disable or enable those things. Right. Well, this is pretty simple. So. Create world. Nigel and Friends, created on the 4th, no wait, the 10th of April, why has it got the 4th first? It's supposed to be 10 or 4, 2015. Because that looks like it's the uh, 4th of September, no, October. Yeah, but it's not the 4th of October, it's the 10th of April. Uh, right. Cleaning up source code. While it's loading, why don't you tell me how your day's been? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, wait. Yep, you're gonna have to stop there, because we're playing now. Wow, okay. I need to put the sensitivity up. Settings... Uh, quality, controls, mouse sensitivity, let's put that up, save, okay, back, uh, and a bit more, settings, controls, let's put it pretty much right to the max, save, okay, back, and yeah, it's okay. It's not the best, but yeah. So, shift is to sprint. Um, that. That animation, though. <laughs> okay. And I've got an axe as well. I only have five slots on my hotbar. Do I have an inventory? Yes, I do. Armor, equipment. Right. So I guess, um, is it like Terraria? Where you can have buffs and extra tools? Well, I'm going to do the first thing in any sandbox survival. Get some wood. I mean, this is pretty much... What you do in Minecraft as well. Oh! Well then. Okay. Right. And now. Um. What? No! No! No, I dro. How are you. S Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> I dropped my tool and I was like, how do I pick it up? But it's okay, I found out. 
It's got the same controls as uh, Unturned. So F is to so ooh, F is to select things, and um, E. I don't think E does anything. No, it doesn't. Uh, I is to bring up your inventory. So let's see. Uh, we've got three logs. Oh wait, crafting. Okay. Small shelter. A small temporary shelter. Maybe suitable to survive the first night, but it does not look very stable. Requires 32 sticks. And a fireplace. Alright, so resources. Lights. Lumber. Stick. Pieces of log. Craft item. Sticks. I need 38 sticks, so resources, lumber. Let's turn all my lumber into sticks. Wait. Requires one lumber. Oh, okay. Have I done it? General? Yes! Okay, so we've built a small shelter. Crafting stations. 16 lumber, so. Oh, wait, what's that over there? There's like a. What is that? Is that an animal? Hello? It's a fox. Hello. How are you? Where are you going? What? Are you just running away from me? He is, isn't he? Well, the reaction of the fox is a bit delayed as to when I go to it. Oh, uh, yeah, it it sees me and kinds of, kind of like, are you friendly? Nope, run away. <laughs> right. Um, I guess we just need some more trees. So let's chop this one down. Yeah. Swing that axe. Oh! 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 oh, oh, oh. That's close. Alright, and there goes the, uh, the logs. Come on, pick it up. Can I not pick it up? Oh, wait. Yeah, I can. It was just... Ah, right. So I've got to wait for the animation to stop before I can actually pick things up. I think that's what was happening there anyway. I just picked a berry. Don't know whether I was supposed to do that, but I did it anyway. More berries. Flowers? Oh, I see what's going on. I think there's a tiny bit of lag because of uh, the recording. But it should be fine. Man, look, there's a the moose or a deer, whatever that is. What are you? A goat. Right. Okay, then. That's fine by me, you just continue being a goat. Yeah, there is a, a little bit of lag. Only when picking up things, though. Unless there is more lag and I just can't see it. Uh, right. What are you? Hello? 
You are a sheep. Race. Okay. Sure. It's got a bit of a rocky court. Okay. I'm back and I've made a little bit of a cave. I also made some uh, torches. So let's see, how do I move it? Ah! Okay. So I move that down there. I don't need those right now. I don't need that right now. I need that. Oh! Oh my! That's... Can I place this down? Uh... If I can, I don't know how to. Oh! I was typing something there. Is it? Whoa! Did not know I could do that. Okay, that's enough of that. Uh, yeah, I don't know how to. Uh, it's really annoying because I can't see what I'm digging. I wanna, like. I wanna see what's down there, but. I don't know how to place the. To the controls menu! Settings, controls, move forward, strafe left, jump, crouch, sprint, walk, drop item, yep. Primary action, mouse left. Secondary action, interaction, inventory, compass, okay, clock, uh, right, so, I don't actually think I can place this, I'm gonna have to like, I don't know, guess what I'm digging. I guess I could just dig towards the light a bit. Uh, okay, well, I'll try and find some stone in this darkness. Alright guys, well, I was able to get some uh, stone, so now I've got some stone, I may actually be able to make a fireplace. Now to do with that, I need logs and stone, so I think I've got all the resources I need to make a fireplace. Let me just get rid of this. There we go. Yeah, okay, I can make a fireplace. So, craft. And now if I go to my inventory. Right. Press F1 for help. Rotates the object around Y axis. Okay. Right. Reverts rotation. Hold to enable free looking. Hold to enable object. Right. Okay. Ah. Placing fireplace. Right. Okay, so at least we can place those. I'm not sure why we couldn't um, place the torch. It's a bit weird, but... Yeah, so... I've got a little bit... This is what I had to dig in the dark. Like, I had to keep getting my torch out. And having a look, because... Either either you can't place them, or I'm just like really stupid and don't know how to place it down. Yeah, I, I don't think you can place these, so... Yeah. Hopefully they add that feature in uh, later on. So let's just get a little bit more stone. I mean, we've got the shelter. And we've got the light. We've got the food as well. 
because I picked those berries and um, we've also got these things, watermelons. Right, okay. Now my next step is to make a crafting station. And with that, I guess I'll be able to make a lot more objects and items. So let me just uh, clear out some space. And we can place a crafting station down. As you probably guessed, this is going to be like my temporary base, or perhaps even a more permanent one. But hopefully we'll be able to like go out and explore the world a bit, see what's what. Oh! When did it become night time? I think this is a perfect time to uh, put the shelter down. I'm guessing that the shelter allows you to skip the night. Maybe. I uh, didn't want to break that bit. How do I place things down again? Oh! Okay. So you can just right click. It's weird as well because on the hotbar, um, mouse up is to go right and mouse down is to go left. And I'm used to it being the other way around, so mouse down to go right. And mouse up to go left, yes. Yeah, just because I've been playing way too much Minecraft. <laughs> Okay, let's fill those bits in. There we go. Almost done. Perfect. Okay, let's place the shelter down. Do do do. Get that there. Get this up there. Right. I don't want it there. This isn't really going to fit, is it? Ah, oh, wait. Th then again. Maybe it does. Alright, oh, so yeah. I guess it does skip the night. I didn't even need to close my eyes to sleep. I am Jesus. Oh yeah. So now that we've got those items, um, I'm going to place a workbench. I just clear out a bit more room. Just because... Uh, what the... Well... So this has been Rising World. <clears throat> As you can probably tell, it's in alpha. Uh, yeah, very buggy still. So, I just fell through the world there, and my character died. Okay, so... If you want to buy this game on Steam, it's about £11. Do I keep my items? No, I do not. But it's okay anyway, because... We can just chop down some more trees, and pickaxe some more, like, logs and stuff. Yeah, we, we only had, like, starting materials. Um, yeah, so, it is pretty much just like Minecraft. Um, also, if you've played the game Seven Days to Die, it's like that, except without the zombies. So, you know, if you're into just, like, sandboxy type games where you can build stuff and, uh, try not to fall through worlds and things, then this is the game for you. Also, it's worth mentioning this game is multiplayer, so you can go on servers with your friends and things. Uh, so yeah, I will see you guys in the next video.